Alan, how you doing? Uh, I've just got off of Bank um, the tube station because I'm off to City Road. Uh, as you see by the thumbnail, uh, that's what I'm having to eat. Now I've been to India, or the India it's called. That was amazing. So I've just found there's an India 2. So I don't know if it's the same company, it may be, but if it's anything like the India, I'm in for a treat. Literally just behind me there is the Ned. I've mentioned it on a few of my vlogs in the past. It's my favourite place in London. Yeah, that, that whole thing is the Ned. It was an old Midland bank. There's, I think, five or six restaurants in there, which are all amazing. There's a private members club, which, uh, I'd love to be a member someday, but hey. Um, it's just, if you haven't been, oh, wow. Yeah, they've got express lunch specials. So you have two courses for $12.95. Um, and they got a special um, Thali set lunch. And $15.95. And do you know what? That is still amazing. I'm gonna go for that, I think. Right. Express lunch. I'm gonna go for the special Thali. Special thali, only special onion. You have to choose rice or non veg. Uh, rice, please. With rice, yeah? That's yeah. it? That's it. And this I... comes, everything will come in. This is thali, yeah. you get curry, you get tikka, sagalu, raita, and rice. Everything one big plate, yeah. Oh, it all this comes together. Thali, yeah. yes, Perfect. Thank you. This is, okay, no need. Do you like any extra bread or are you okay? No, no, I'm good. Right, thank thank you. you very much. That's good, it all comes together. So it's going to look pretty damn good. Kingfisher as well. mango chutney quite like that it's got its own you can taste its mango chutney but it's got its own little tang nice blue Just 
just asked uh, the member of staff if it's uh, related to the other India. He said yes, and he recognises me from me going there before. And this is one, this one has been open four weeks. So that's a proper little treat. Brand new place. definitely come back for um, an evening meal because no it's not big portions because it, well it's lunch if you want a big portion then you can order that off the menu but the specials that they do are just small dishes and I don't know about you but I'm not a big lunch eater I'd rather have a bigger evening meal so yeah I'll definitely come back and try that but flavor wise off the charts, absolutely spot on. Sagalu, wow, yeah, it's right up there. The Indian, two, and now I've tried both, they are both off the charts, amazing. So, that's that's a few Indian restaurants now that are on my top three list, and this is one of them.
And uh, they've got an upstairs as well. Nice little sort of balcony area. And in the summer, this, this roof comes off. How about that, for our fresco? Also, I love this part of London as well. There's, there's certain parts of London that really grab me. And this is one of them. So City Road, which is EC1. So, I can I describe? So, from Bank, it took me about 12 to 15 minutes to walk here. Just, um, just off of uh, Finsbury Square and Finsbury Green. So uh, it's I just it's a great area. Well, you've even got uh, Giovanni's there. Giovanni's, forget about it. But yeah, the India, one and two. Totally recommend it, 100%. The flavours out of this world, honestly. Um, yes, they're small dishes. It was a lunch special. Uh, if you want bigger dishes, then you can order bigger dishes. But like I said earlier, it's lunch. I don't need to eat a lot for lunch. But quality, yeah, I'll take that. And that's got loads of it. So, staff were amazing. Uh, very friendly. So yeah, there you go. The India 2. Thanks Damon, John. I'll see you in the next one. come back um, Liverpool Street station way so I'm going to get the Elizabeth line just for a change but just behind the station got a place called Timothy Orton just in the, the door handle brilliant but what a spectacle like you've got all these high-end shops you know um, Selfridges and they've got all their shop windows. Check this out. How's this for a, a little dining capsule? Yeah, sorry, can I have that book on the bottom, please? No? Okay. See? I never knew this was here. Just, I love getting lost in London and finding these things. It's a hidden gem.